Okay, another important thing about jumping is foot placement on the foot pegs. As you may know from some of my previous videos, there's two different positions to have your feet on the foot pegs. Either on the balls of your feet, which is right there between the toe and the arch, or on the arch of your foot, which is right there on the arch. And the only time you should be on the balls of your feet is when you're not going to need the shifter or the brake. You can be on the balls of your feet. If you're going to need the shifter or the brake, you should be right there in the arch of your feet, foot. That way you can get right on the brake or the shifter over here. It's the same thing on this side anytime you need it. And then out to the side when you don't need it. But you don't want to always be on the arch of your foot if you're not going to need the shifter or the brake. There's three benefits to being on the balls of your feet. One is you have more body travel. You have about four or five inches of body travel there in your ankles. See that difference between that versus up here on the arch, there's no body travel at all. And then the other one is you won't hit the shifter or brake by accident. You can keep your feet straight on. You don't have to put them out to the side. And you won't hit the shifter or brake by accident. And the third one is you're a lot less likely to get your toe caught in the dirt and ripped off the foot peg. If you have the arch of your foot on the peg and you're forward, your toe drops down, you can catch it in a rut, rip it off the foot peg. The only exception to being on the balls of your feet is if you're going to land really hard, like case a jump, it's better to be on the arch of your foot. Because if you're on the balls of your feet, you could go down so hard you could sprain. I know some guys that even have broken their ankle doing that. But other than that, get used to riding on the balls of your feet or the arch of your foot. Know where you're at on the foot pegs. Let's look at it from a different angle.